High. Today we will see a very simple trading strategy called, the open high and open low strategy. Many of you must have already heard of it. First, let's see how the strategy works. This is the very first intraday bar of the day. The time frame could be anything from 1 minute, 3 minutes, 15 minutes, etc. The open value of this bar is equal to its low value. This bar is called the open to low bar. We mark the high and low values of this bar. If a bar breaks out above the high of this level, we take a long entry. The stop loss is below the low level. So this is the open to low bar long trade setup. Similarly, this is the very first intraday bar of the day. The open value of this bar is equal to its high value. This bar is called the open to high bar. We mark the high and low values of this bar. If a bar breaks out below the low of this level, we take a short entry. The stop loss is above the high level. So this is the open to high bar short trade setup. Now, I use this logic and developed a trading strategy in the trading view. This is called the OHOL strategy. Right now I'm on the nifty index 1 minute chart. You can see a few trades here. Let's analyze this 5th of February trade. If I zoom in, we can see this is the first intraday bar of that day. And as you can see, the open value of this bar is equal to its high value. So this is an open to high bar. I will mark the low value of this bar with a horizontal line. And if I zoomed out a little, we can see that this bar here has broken down this level. And therefore, we got a short trade here. The trade will exit either when its stop loss is hit or when the market session closes. So here, our stop loss did not hit throughout the day. So the trade got squared off at the end of the trading session on the very last bar. Let's see a long trade setup. Now, I'm on the 1 minute chart of Reliance stock. And we can see a nice long trade on the 29th of January. If I zoom in, we can see the very first bar of that day. The open value of this bar is equal to the low value. So this is an open to low bar. I will mark the high value of this bar with a horizontal line. And as we can see, this bar here has broken up this level. And therefore, we got a long trade. The trade will end either when the stop loss is hit or when the trading session of the day ends. If I zoom out a little, we can see that the stop loss did not hit. So the trade got squared off at the very last bar of that day and we got a huge rally to cash on. Now, let's see an example where the stop loss has hit. Here we have a short entry. This is the first bar of that day, which is an open to high bar. I will mark the low of this bar. Since this bar has broken down the low level, we got this short trade here. Now, I will mark the high value of this bar. And if I zoom out a little, we can see that this bar has hit the green stop loss level. So the trade got squared off. Now, a good news. I'm making this strategy available for everyone to use. The link to this strategy is given in the description of this video. Copy and paste the link in a web browser. Then, you will see such a page. This is my trading view profile by the way. Please follow it, if you may like. Then, scroll down a bit. And you will see this blue colored button called, Add to Favorite Indicators. Click it. Now open any stock chart. Go to the Indicators section. Select the Favorites option. And here you will see the indicator listed. Just click it and you are free to use it. I hope this helps you. Thanks for watching.